Xiaomi has officially announced its flagship smartphone lineup for the second half of the year, the Xiaomi 12T and 12T Pro. Here is everything you need to know about the 12T Pro. The 12T Pro has a curved glass back with a frosted finish that subtly diffuses light and doesn't cling onto fingerprints too readily. The phone is relatively big, with its 6.7-inch screen, and it isn't light at 205 gram. That said, it's still manageable. With its 6.7-inch, 20-9 screen, the Xiaomi 12T Pro is a tall handful. It has a punch-hole selfie camera in the top center of the display, and there's a pre-fitted screen protector, too, atop a flat Gorilla Glass 5 panel. This is an AMOLED dot display with an adaptive refresh rate that switches automatically between 30Hz, 60Hz, 90Hz, and 120Hz, promising from a battery-saving point of view. It also benefits from a 480Hz touch sampling rate, so is super responsive, which should make the 12T Pro ideal for gamers. Capping out at 500 nits when setting it manually, and 900 nits in high brightness mode. With Dolby Vision and HDR10 Plus credentials, as well as an in-display fingerprint scanner. The headline feature of the Xiaomi 12T Pro is its 200MP camera, and it's seriously impressive, both on paper and in the flesh. Measuring 1-1.22 inches, its sensor is physically larger than the new primary sensor on the iPhone 14 Pro Max, which is mighty, given the price difference between the two phones. Its photos of objects captured nearer than 40 centimeters away are loaded with background blur. The 12T Pro's main camera sensor is a Samsung Isis LHP1 HP1 with 0.64 micron pixels although it combines 16 pixels into one hexadeca binning to create a 2.56 micrometers superpixel, producing 12MP photos by default. The main camera's lens has an f/1.69 aperture and features eight elements, shooting with an 85 degrees field of view. More impressive is the fact the 12T Pro's main camera packs OIS and can record video at up to 8K resolution. The secondary cameras don't warrant such an in-depth overview. The 8MP ultra-wide camera brings nothing new to the table with its small a quarter-inch sensor size and 120 degrees FOV, and the 2MP macro camera seems like a poorly specced filler. As for selfies, the 12T packs a 20MP front camera with an f/2.24 aperture. With Android 12 out of the box and Xiaomi's Mi UI 13 over the top, anyone who's used a Xiaomi, Redmi, or Poco phone in the last 12 months will know roughly what to expect from the 12T Pro software. The phone ships with 256GB as standard in the UK, with 8GB RAM, it should multitask smoothly across apps, too, even with Xiaomi's aggressive battery manager. Also attention-grabbing is the Qualcomm Snapdragon 8 Plus Gen 1 chipset powering the 12T Pro. With the Snapdragon 8 Plus Gen 1 performing so much better than the original 8 Gen 1 when it comes to heat management, this could make the 12T Pro the best Xiaomi phone out now for gamers. With a 5000 mAh battery, the Xiaomi 12T Pro packs a competitive capacity that should ensure it makes it through a full day without any issues, especially with the phone's relatively paired-back screen brightness. With 120W wired charging, Xiaomi claims you can power up the 12T Pro in as little as 19 minutes, and there's a fast charger in the box too. The only thing missing, as far as we're concerned, is wireless charging. On first impressions, the Xiaomi 12T Pro is a value champ, with its 256GB storage capacity and Qualcomm Snapdragon 8 Plus Gen 1 power. It isn't cheap, and there are compromises. There's no wireless charging, for example, and the phone's plastic frame and flat screen aren't as premium as some of the curved glass and metal competition. It's also worth noting, the phone's camera isn't an across-the-board champion, the ultra-wide and macro cameras are, on paper, mediocre to poor. That said, the 200MP primary camera arguably compensates for any imaging shortcomings. It has a huge sensor size, a sky-high resolution, and after our initial encounter, delivers mighty results. We reckon the 12T Pro will be a really good, affordable gaming phone for anyone who really loves taking photos. Xiaomi's photo processing is also generally more natural-looking than that of Motorola, so we're optimistic that the 12T Pro will indeed be an excellent camera phone too.